Hey guys, Penna Daily here, and welcome back to Let's Play Okami Den. In the last episode, we finished off the uh, Knowing Jewel quest and uh, dealt with a an author's creation that had gone out of control. I know that feeling. Uh, and uh, now we need to exercise the Gorio. This is unacceptable. How de dare demons attack this ship? My ship! I fear I may have to draw one of my swords and hold it in the general direction of the demon. I have the sinking feeling that he doesn't know how to use a sword. I guess it's up to us. Well, you know, he's a monk. He probably used, uh, what's it, um, blunt objects. That's, that's in D&D, &D, right? Okay, meet old green imps. They are original green imps. Y'all are annoying me. Alright, if you power slash him, you remember, that was his original, you can get a demon skin, which is good. Yeah, that's how they attack, which is different than before. But they still shake their ass at you. And... good. So I might actually be able to get those, uh, that upgraded rosary. Might. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Just six to go. And... talk to Ben Kay. That demon would have tasted my blade. Do I you should be grateful that we saved you. But now... The boat is damaged and I won't be able to return home. Curse that demon. And my rotten luck. That boat's not going anywhere. Think you can fix it, Squiddy? Of course we can! They like this, uh, shape for holes in boats and tanks and other things. Not that we really need the praise, but you might. This is truly a blessing. I will be able to make it to the city. Yes, you will. So, now we come this way. Got anything interesting to say, dude? Hello there. Uh, no. No, we're good this time. I just wondered if you had something new to say. And, oh look, another demon. Okay, what have we got up here? A uh, nymph, water nymph. Okay, keep away from her because if she catches you, she is going to do that. Jump, to stay out of the way. Good. Stay away, stay away, stay away. All right. Good. Okay. No. Let's see if this works. Yes, we get a demon liver! An organ so vile, it throbs with evil. Yeah, that's my opinion of most liver. <laughs> it's ashy. Just five to go. All right, so now we get to go down. Where is our next? Well, we can go either way, but let's, um, let's just go this way. I mean, you could drop and it probably would get you there faster, and that's the wrong, that's the wrong door. <sighs> hmm. 
Oink, oink. Yeah, by the way, does this room, now that you know, are pretty sure you know what ship this is, yeah, does this room look familiar? This is where you got attacked by the seaweed monster. Ah, you know, red wildfire, spawn point. Scroll. Okay, meet an old red imp. Yeah, uh, you probably remember how to deal with these jerks. When they block. Ow. All right, uh, this guy should still be power slash. But I don't think I got anything, so maybe he's not. You're beginning to annoy me here, dude. Oh, no, wait. He's not dead yet. Now he's dead. Yeah, sorry. Alright. Yeah, not too bad. Let's see, what's next? Just four to go. No, I guess I just overkilled it. It should, in fact, be... Uh, it... The, screw you. Power Slash should be the thing's, um... That floral finisher. I don't really like that. Okay. So who have we got here? You again. Okay, move it. Good. And here we go again. Oh, oh boy. And power slash. Ah, demon liver. Yum. Chicken liver isn't really that bad. Beef livers are ashy. Just three to go. Got anything interesting? Thanks for your help. I'm glad this fish tank is okay. Same. I'm glad I could help some underwater friends. Yeah, given that we know what happens to them in the... Oh, look! <laughs> so who the hell did this? Ouch! Probably the demons. Okay, um, let's see, can I... Nope. Nah. Ignoring you. Ow. Got anything to say? Deep blue sea villains? Yeah, another thing coming if they think they'll take the ship. Nothing's gonna. Ah. Yeah. The... Mm. Ouch. Ouch. 
All right. Squiddy, that man's in trouble. We have to help him. Okay, sure. Fight. Again. Sorry, I start concentrating because I want those demon skins for various reasons. All right, time to die. Oh, look. And you. There we go. And slash. There's two of them. All right. Oh, hey, we get a demon liver. And power slash. Slash. I don't know how well we did, but screw it. <laughs> Partner help! Yeah, Nanami didn't really help that much, but screw it. I think I have enough to buy Whirlwind the next time I get to Yakushi Village. Yeah, you certainly got some spirit! Are you hurt, mister? Are you kidding? Look at me, fell like a rock. Too mad I'm not as young as I used to be, or I'd give you a hand. Don't worry about it. You're safe for not getting involved. <laughs> yeah, you got me, though. I gotta act my age, I guess. It's about time I let the youngins have a turn at all the fun. It's just two to go. Yep. So. Well. Did I hear a frog? Yep. Electric toad. There we go. You've got to get them when they're not, you know, sparking. Ice toads, of course. Elemental toads. Got anything? Where'd all these monsters come from? I hate to say it, but the ship can't survive this. It's not over yet. We can do something about these nasty creatures. Green wildfire, if you did not catch them. Ow. Screw you. Yep, if you did not get them, you know, back where they were originally in the whatever dungeon, you can get them here. I don't know if you necessarily... Uh-huh. Shock. Gotcha. You know, just in case. That was stupid. That is what I need to do. There we go. Because, of course, there's one in here. What have we got? Three green imps. Well, old green imps. I think I probably hit him, but eh. Nope. I managed not to overkill the jerk. Yeah, there. And yeah, combos are probably better. I think we hit him. Oh, no, we didn't. There we go. We 
probably did better on partner health this day. Well, that's better than seeds. Right. Only one left now. Yep. Okay, just checking. And... So now we get to go back to the treasure room. And I suppose this is also going to explain... You know, just screw you, dude. Why the lucky mallet is on this ship. So, no, I was really expecting there to be a... Something in the treasure room, but no, where's that last scroll? Hmm. Yep. No, I'm missing one. Okay. Let's see. Two on the upper deck. I got those. Ah, okay, I think I know where the last one is. <sighs> we'll have to go this way and back out, but you know how that is. Once again, through Frog Central. Apparently these are the same toads. <sighs> we gotta go back up. At least I'm fairly sure. Let's see, one in that one. Can't actually go over that, really? I think there might be one in here. I could be wrong. There is one up here! I'll defend this. He's very brave, but we can defeat those demons for him. Yes. Yes, we can. All right, um... Two old red imps. Okay. Okay, I wonder what'll happen if I do that. Nice! All right, get him. Honestly, with these guys, what you should be doing is charging your glaive while you have, while they're away from you, and then once you're in, whackalate. Because combos are good. All right, now, once this happens, we're gonna move right on, so this might be a slightly longer episode, because I don't know when I'm gonna get to save. Well, that's that. Let's go to the captain and tell the captain the problem is done now. And we automatically do so. Very nice work, you two. We're ready to set sail. All hands on deck, raise the anchor. I must return to the Dragon Palace now. I had fun playing with you. Maybe someday we can have an adventure on land. Um. Although I doubt that will ever happen. Hello, irony meter. What? Really? How do you know? Time travel. 
with its cornucopia of disturbing concepts, as Ron said. I guess I'll just take your word for it. I'm sure we'll have a lot of fun then. Uh... Okay then, see you again someday, Squiddy. Really? She was chasing that frickin' catfish for nine months? Ah! The dry and wet jewels! Come back! Give those back! She spent nine months chasing that damn catfish. Man, that felt like a waste of time. Oh crap, I missed an Isun masterpiece back in Nanami's. I'm gonna have to go back and do that. There was a shell in that room that I should have bloomed. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna have to go back and do that. Ah, uh, crap. Dude, you're kidding, right? Why does he need the blood of Orochi? Seriously, if he washes in it, he like becomes perfect? Hold on, dude, this is coming at me too fast. So I'm gonna have to do that off screen. <laughs> go back, do that, get back here. Orochi was defeated by Amaterasu on the 15th night in the Moon Cave. At least that's what it says here. And, uh, um, tonight is the 15th night. I bet you Akuro is going to steal the blood from Orochi's corpse. That guy doesn't need to be any more powerful. Come on. We got to get to the Moon Cave on the double. Hold on, boy. Did you, like, get a bit pudgy or something, dude? What the heck are you carrying around? The lucky mallet. We have to leave it here. If I'm gonna move quickly, you'll have to leave it behind, okay? Don't worry about it. I'll take good care of it. We're gonna return to the city. Just drop by and pick it up later. Oh, ow. Because if you haven't played the first game, that sounds like a, a regular, um... Quest. Yeah, Look! Otohime's come back! Uh, no. No, I'm afraid not. Color's not quite right. Spots are wrong. Uh -oh. It's not her! It's... Uh -oh. It's the water dragon! Yeah, hi King Waka, or Wada. He's pretty diesel. That Barracuda is gonna sink this boat if we don't stop him. These dudes helped us out, so we gotta return the favor. Pretty boy, let's do this. Halt! We don't need your help with this sea fodder. What are you doing, Captain? All me men are seafarers with nerves of steel as they panic in the background. You would only get in the way. Uh-huh. That's not what he means. No way, dude. That big snake's too powerful for humans to fight. We can do... No, you have a more important task at hand. Go, leave this to us. But, but... Don't worry, kid. We're men of the sea. This boat will be fine. Old dude. You're crazy if you think you can fight that dude. <laughs> you youngin' so eager to get your chance. But... But us old people still got a trick or two left. As long as my ticker is still ticking, I'm gonna keep fighting. I'm not ready to shuffle off this mortal coil, not by a long shot. In fact, I feel sorry for that water dragon, because he has to face me. My blood is boiling, and he's going to feel it. See? What'd I tell you? Like I said, we got it all under control. Yeah, he knows better. I guess you do. Oh, 
Oh man, that old guy. Oi mates, you go there and you win it, you hear me? You're not that far from the moon cave. Just don't do anything stupid before you get there. Forget it, dude. There's nothing we can do. It's not our fight. Our job is to stop Akira. I know you don't like it, but that's the way it is. No looking back, okay? We're going to the moon cave. I can't believe I managed to forget that stupid shell or stupid masterpiece. And here we are at the moon cave. We should find Orochi in the moon cave there. If the history scroll is right, Amaterasu and Kushi will be there too. Look, there's some dude. And now we're, you know that guy? Now we're getting into one of the things I don't like about, get out of here, that's the great Susano. I don't like about this, this game story. And he's on his way to put down Orochi. I know that's what goes down, but I still can't believe he's the one. Yo, dude! Who, who goes there? Who are you? What do you want? Oh, sorry. The name's Kuro. All you need to know is that I came here on a shooting star. Okay. This pup here is my partner. He's good at fighting off demons. A demon-fighting pup. That seems to be the trend with dogs these days. In fact, you're a dead ringer for a certain pup I know. Except you're a little shorter. So, what are you, like, doing here, dude? The woman I love is going to be sacrificed to that foul beast Orochi. Fido and the bug already went to the cave. I should be there right now, standing by their side. Yeah, you should, literally, because they should have fed you to the... Right, just like in the scroll. Huh? Well, maybe he did get spat all the way back here, but it seems... You don't see something floating in the water out there. Look, it's right there. It's Cooney. It, it's a child. He looks hurt. That kid is the Cooney guy you were talking about? I like this bit. Because, <laughs> but I guess this is where Susano first found him. He's not breathing. <laughs> CPR, clean, pretty reliable. Yeah, um, he really shouldn't be doing chest compressions if Cooney's just not breathing. Also, when you do mouth-to-mouth, -mouth, especially in this case, there's a very good chance there will throw up in your mouth. I can't take a child with me. I need to find a place to keep him safe. Ah, there we go. I love how even in the, um, the cutscene, the entry icon is there. This poor child. I won't let any demons touch him. Not on my watch. I know, I keep giving him the captain's accent. I'm sorry. Yeah, this is going to be a long-ass episode. Okay. Alright. Good. There we go. And let's get a lever. Ah. There we go. And a demon skin. Ah, eh, not too bad. Yeah, hopefully there will be a save soon because yeah, this is taking a while. But oh well. Nice work, pup. Yep. 
I'll bring him to the Moon Shrine. You two wait out here. I can't fuck that up. Oh well. I'll ha I'll be do I'll go back and do that off screen. Wow, he's not as incompetent as he looks. Shut up, Kuro. Uh, mm. Yeah, this bit is good, but we're coming up on one of the things with Susano that really you know, I don't like. I'll call on the priest after I've rescued Kushi. <sighs> Sounds like a plan. Okay, I'm coming for you, Kushi! So we got monsters, monsters, more monsters, a save mirror, and of course, the moon cave, nine months ago. Oh good, so let's get past the monsters. Uh, the gargoyles, of course. You can mostly just get right past them. We've got a demon who sells you shit, but uh, I'm not dealing with that right now. We're just going to save, because this has been half an hour. Yes, we're saving. So, thank you guys for joining me for Let's Play Okami Den, and I will see you next time. Have a great evening. Goodbye.